Hi guys and welcome back to our let's play of Fallout New Vegas. We are here in Novak and yeah, let's start exploring this town and see what we can find here. Last time it was night time, uh, I suppose it still is. So maybe we will have to wait. Oh no, there's a caravan coming. How did they survive all the um, Legion guys? Traveling merchant. And he's alone. No, he is not. He has a mercenary. So let's talk to him. Hey there. Need anything? Uh, I'd like to see your sure. wares. Here's what I've got. Let's see. Do we have stuff to sell? Weapons. We have a full magnum. We could sell this one. Oh, he has a lot of money, nice. Oh, this one isn't worth anything. So, let's trash it. This one is... is full, so let's sell this one. Let's sell this one. This one is full also, let's sell this one. We have to get rid of, rid of some of these weapons because we are always too heavy. Okay, weapons we are good on. Leather armor. Our helmet, the condition is pretty low, but we have to remind us to repair our armor when we find some. Anti-venom, yucca fruit, barrel cactus fruit, book of science. Let's see what we have here that we can sell. Dirty water, sell. Um, these ones are quite good. Hydra is worth a little, quite a bit. Um, let's see, maize. It's not worth much and it's probably an ingredient for some crafting. Um, we have 15 psycho. Maybe we will sell five of these. Um, purified water. Stealth boys. We have three. Stimpex nine. Sunset sarsaparilla. We have 35 of these. Wow. Uh, but they are not worth much. And they heal a lot. Okay, A is done, misc. Let's see. Cases. Holes. Lead. Cigarettes. Um, Pre-war money. Let's sell these. Uh, not much else to sell. Ammo we won't sell. Yeah, that's it, I suppose. So accept. And exit. Where is she going? Oh, she's going into town. Okay. Let's see, there were some people down here. Is this a caravan too? Yes, it looks like it. We had talked to these ones, yes? Hello. Yeah. Okay, so the town seems to only be that. Well, maybe here's some houses. Maybe there's something going on here. Whose house is this? Oh, a Brahmin farm. At least it looks like. Door to McBride house. Who's McBride? Dusty McBride, Alice McBride. Hey, dude. Hey there. In from out of town, ain't you? Name's Dusty. Okay. What do you do here in Novak? Oh, I tend to my ranch. That's about it. Alice will tell you, I don't get out a whole lot. Okay. How is business lately? You must mean what's left of it. Somebody's been attacking our animals at night. We're down to less than half of what we had a few weeks back. Okay. Tell me what you know about the attacks. 
Every night around midnight, Alice and I wake up to some crazy hollering and gunshots. You'd think the world was ending all over again. But it's just one animal each night. They don't take it or carve it up or nothing. Just leave it there, all full of holes. Okay. I'll see if I can catch whoever's responsible. Mm, I don't know. Maybe not for now. I'm looking for a man in a checkered coat. Have you seen anyone like that? Can't say I have, but we usually keep to ourselves down here. You might have more luck up by the motel. Okay. Maybe ask Jeannie May. Nothing happens in this town she don't know about. She'll be up in the lobby most days. Um. Did you get a look at the attacker? Beg your pardon, mister, but them two-headed beeves ain't worth getting shot over. Not to mention what would happen if half of what Nobark says is true. Best we can hope is that whoever's doing this will move on or get tired of it. I just hope it happens while we still got animals left. Whoever it is, I don't think they're from around town. Seems like they've taken to shooting from the west side. Okay. Goodbye. So long. So we could help these guys. Let's see what else is going on. Someone living here, no lights on. Neutra weapons and sunset sarsaparilla, nice. Yeah, here's some lights on. Novak house. Let's see. Anyone in here? Yes, a lot of people. Novak settler, Novak settler. Novak Settler. They have some guns and some food. What is this? Some engine. Mm, nothing of interest, it seems. Novak is quite big. What's that over there? There's a big tower. Um, where are we on the map? Um, uh, not... Yeah, I know we are in Novak, but Gibson Scrapyard. That's probably what I saw right now. Abandoned bunker and here is the dam. Okay, and we can get into Vegas from here also. And there is something big over there. Okay. Let's see this house. Oh, there's... Uh, did I go into this one? I don't think so. Let's see who lives here. Door to Jeannie Mae Crawford's house. Okay, we can talk to her at daytime. He said she was always... Oh, this house is burned down. Okay, that's why they're dead. Uh, there's two... Um, graves there, probably. There's a shack down here. What's this shack? Ah, it has... Mm, not much, but has... Um, a workbench. This is all stealing, but we can activate the workbench. Conversion MFC to SEC3 microfusion cell. And recycle microfusion cells. Oh, we only need the drained ones for this. And for this we need microfusion cells. Okay, let's do this. Seven microfusion cells. And I don't know what this is. Uh, no, let's cancel this. I don't know what this does. What is this SEC? Hmm, I will wait with that. So, it's quite late, it seems. Who lives here? Novak House, more settlers probably. Yeah. Ah, a lot of people live here. Quite nice. Oh, we can take this stuff without problems. So the settlers don't have 
a claim on this stuff. This is the big motel. What's this? Another shack. Is it shut? Door to no bark shack. Who is no bark? all over who sent you I ain't talking they tried to get me to talk before but I didn't say nothing and I don't aim to now by gum I don't mean any harm we'll just see about that you come any closer and I'm liable to stick you with my sticking knife old stick is feeling mighty ornery this day <laughs> we can talk from this distance you sure now? It's kind of hard to hear you. Glare at no bark. Okay, okay, just speak up a little. But not so much that they hear you. They got people everywhere, always listening. Why do they call you no bark? Because they know I ain't just barking here. What I say is got bite. Cause it's the truth. Them quack doctors can say what they want about all the rad scorpion stings that done pierced my skull. And I know what I seen. Okay. What's been going on in town? There's been things of a disturbing nature going on at the McBride Corral. Seems every night one of their herd meets a most unnatural death. And always there's holes all over the body. Work of the chupacabra, the livestock vampire, says Nobark, but they don't pay no mind. Too many holes, they say, and there's bullets in them. Well, says Nobark, we got a chupacabra with an automatic weapon. <laughs> and that's when they get real quiet, because now they see the predicament we're in. <laughs> oh, man. What else do you know about the deaths at the corral? I come face to face with the Chupacabra himself one night, whilst I was investigating whether this gecko was hiding his treasure from me. He was the meanest, ugliest Chupacabra you could imagine. Had two heads and fangs down to the ground. Best I could tell anyways, since when he come up to me he was invisible. Had himself a blunderbuss, what would rotate and shoot bullets real fast out of a backpack. Never seen nothing like it. Walked right past me having an argument with somebody. But I only saw one chupacabra, so I guess the other fella had to be invisible too. Only more invisible than the other one. Okay. Sounds interesting. Is anything interesting happening in the area? Folks will tell you that they seen ghouls up near the rocket factory. Sensationalist hooey. Cooked up by superstitious yokels, seeing phantoms of their own imagining. Okay, he's calling others superstitious. Um, who do you think is actually at the factory? Ghosts. Kami ghosts, who don't know they're dead. Hoping to steal our rockets, so they can fly up and paint the moon pink and draw a Lenin face on it. I've seen one of them disappear and reappear before my very eyes. Although, being a scientist, I have to admit I might have just blinked for longer than usual, what with the shock of seeing a commie ghost and so forth. Okay. Um, I'm looking for a man in a checkered coat. Have you seen anyone like that? Sure have. Camouflage, that coat was, trying to hide from extraterrestrials what can only see in black and white checkers. But they're not fooled, because he forgot to put checkers on his face. I told him so, and he seemed to take it to heart. They stayed here a night, and was up by the dinosaur, talking to the sniper fellow with the mustache a couple of times. Okay, by the dinosaur? Good to know. Um... No, caravan, I can't play that, asks, so... We never spoke. Okay. Sure. We never spoke. Oh, man. He's quite prepared. And he will not run out of empty soda bottles. So is that the rocket factory? Probably. Let's see what quests did we get there. 
Um, here we asked around. Now find out from many Vargas where the cans were headed. Okay, that's probably Manny Vargas, probably the guy from the dinosaur. Head to the Repcon facility west of Novak to investigate rumors of ghoul activity. Ghoul activity. Um, these are all the still the um, DLC missions. Okay, so not much new, only to talk to the guy at the dinosaur. Let's see, does this get me anywhere? Doesn't look like much. Oh, the caravan is continuing their way that way. Okay. Uh, oh no, that's probably the caravan that was outside. The other one is probably still in here, spending the night, I suppose. Or maybe it's the same one, I don't know. Can't we get in through here? Doesn't look like it. Probably there's... I oh, know, there was no loading screen. Um, I think. to enter the motel. Those are still there. What time is it? Because he said every every night at midnight. It's four in the morning, okay. So midnight is still a ways to go. Um, there's lights on everywhere here. Are all these rooms occupied? Manny Vargas room, motel room, Door to Bones room, Boon, Boons room or Bones, Boons. Motel room, oh that one isn't stealing. Motel room, Motel room, some are stealing, some are not, so probably some are occupied, others are not. Door to Motel room requires a, qu a key. So, yeah, there are a few little houses also. This is quite the setup. Ranger Andy's bungalow and Cliff Briscoe's bungalow. Okay. So let's wait until it's daytime. Um, what was waiting? This one. Okay. Um, it's four, five, six, seven, eight. I suppose at eight it should be daytime already. So let's see. Is anyone here at the reception? Yes. Hello. Well, welcome to you. You look tired from the road. Why don't you relax a spell? Let this fine town take care of you. Ah, quite a hospitable person. We haven't met yet. Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and plain forgot to tell you my name. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel, long as they aren't troublemakers. What is this place? We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel, and it's mine. What is there of interest around here? Well, there's Dinky, the town mascot. He's a sight. You probably already saw him when you came in, but you can go up inside, too. Up the roadways to the west, there's Repcon. That's the old rocket factory. There's been some sinister characters out there lately, so you may want to stay clear. Other than that, nothing to do but take it easy and enjoy good company. Anything else? Well, up north a ways, you'll see a big tower. That's Helios 1. Used to be a power plant in its day. And there's a town just east of here called Nelson. Used to be such a quaint little place until those slavers took it over. But we got our wonderful snipers keeping an eye in that direction, and so far, the slavers have left us alone. Okay. Tell me more about Repcon. I just know what I've heard. 
they're supposed to be some ghouls that went in a while back. Ever so often, there'll be a commotion from that direction, explosions and such. Watch out for strangers. Uh, hello. I was I still hope talking you're to you. Everything to your liking. Um, where can I get some supplies? What's been going on in town lately? Well, let's see. Dusty McBride's been losing some Brahmin, but that's probably the heat more than anything. Honestly, it's been real quiet. Ranger Andy's still hurt, but we got these two gentlemen snipers watching the road day and night, keeping the trash out of Novak. They've been a blessing. Okay. Where can I get some supplies? Go see Cliff Briscoe at the Dino Bite gift shop and tell him I sent you. I think he gets lonely standing around in that dino belly all day. He'll be glad for the company. Okay. Goodbye. Watch out for strangers. So here we can rent a room. In the dino belly. Uh, but I thought the gift shop was out there. Wasn't it? No, maybe I was confused. I stayed in the gift shop overnight. Or not. No, I stayed somewhere else. Yes, we have T-Rexes. <laughs> Hi, dude. How you do? Welcome to the Dino Bite gift shop. My name's Cliff. If you're here for the T-Rex figurines, you're just in time. There's still a few left. <laughs> what do you sell here? Well, there's T-Rex figurines, of course. That's our bread and butter. We also have an assortment of the Repcon factory souvenirs, rockets, things of that nature. Hmm. How about supplies and guns? Do you sell those? Guns? I, uh, well, yeah, I guess I might have a few. Darn it, no one ever buys the T-Rexes. <laughs> um, tell me more about the souvenir rockets. They're scale replicas of the real thing. Very detailed. Got a liquid in them that makes them glow. From what I hear, Repcon used to give them out on tours of their HQ up in Henderson. But I guess they had to stop after the first few kids thought they were filled with Nuka-Cola and drank it down. Oh. The papers had a name for the condition and everything. They called it the Repcon Shakes. Those were bad times for Robco. Um, how did they end up here? Well, they unloaded what they had left on the Dino Bite as a tax write-off, but that was before my time. Plenty of demand for them, seeing as how they're one-of-a-kind collector's items, but I might still have some in back. Okay. Jenny May sent me. Bless her. Seems like every traveler I get in here tells me the same thing. They see the sign and think, gift shop? That's just too good to be true. But Jeannie May always points them back in my direction. Well, a friend of Jeannie's is a friend of mine. And my friends get a discount at my store. Okay, goodbye. Come back soon now. Who are you? Boone. God damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that. What do you want? Expecting visitors? Yeah, I guess maybe I am. But not like you. Huh. Maybe it should have been you I was expecting all along. Why are you here? I just wanted to check out the view. I think you better leave. Just making friendly conversation. I don't have friends here. This is a weird guy. Well, I'm not from here. No. No, you're not, are you? Maybe you shouldn't go. Not just yet. So now you want something from me? I need someone I can trust. You're a stranger. That's a start. What do you want me to do? 
I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come and what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. You're trying to track down your wife? My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. What do I do if I find this person? Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal so I know you're standing with him. And I'll take care of the rest. I need to do this myself. I'll see what I can do to help you. Good. I'll make it worth your while. And one more thing. We shouldn't speak again. Not until it's over. No one in town knows that I know what happened to my wife. Best they never know. Or the Legion will be after me next. How do you know your wife is dead? I know, alright. That's all you need to know. Goodbye. Yeah. Okay, weird dude. I thought that there would be two guys, always one up here, watching the road. So she said there was a village. East? Repcon test site? Gibson scrapyard, Helios 1, neutral. Rap contest site. Yeah, I think the shed north, south, east, west to the east here somewhere should be a village, but it's it's been taken over by the slavers. So they are watching this site because of that, probably. Where's the other sniper guy? Because supposedly. One of them talked to the checkered jacket guy. You are one of the snipers. Who is the other one? Are you the other sniper? What's going on, man? Who are you? I'm Manny. I'm on security detail here. You see a rifle barrel sticking out of the dinosaur's mouth, you got a 50-50 shot at me. Otherwise, it's boom. What do you protect your town from? You name it. Anything that comes within a thousand yards that looks like trouble. Lately we've been getting ghouls, coming from the road to Repcon out to the west. Quite a few last couple days. The big threat is the Legion coming from the east. If they decide to attack with a full force, they'll run us over. But so far we've been lucky. Okay. Who's Boone? Boone's a sniper. Same as me. Used to spot for him when we were enlisted with the NCR. After we got out, I talked him into settling down here. So, here we are. I'd introduce you, but uh, we're not so friendly right now. Why are you on bad terms with Boone? Me and his wife. We didn't see eye to eye on some things. We had some pretty big arguments. One day, she turns up missing, and he hasn't said a word to me since. Okay. What did you and Boone's wife argue about? Man, you name it. See, I grew up in North Vegas, me and my cousins. We were some bad seeds. Got in with a gang, I loved it. Then something happened and I couldn't handle it anymore. So I enlisted, earned my future, brought down my best friend to share that future with me. And here was this woman who was too good for it, trying to take him away. So yeah, I didn't see eye to eye with the bitch. Wow. <laughs> Did you have anything to do with Boone's wife's disappearance? Who would want to hurt Boone's wife? So you were in a gang? Were they tough? Were they tough? I was in the cons, man. It doesn't get any badder. I'm looking for a man in a checkered coat. Sure I know him. What do you want with him? Um, I'm looking for answers. Must be something pretty important to be chasing a guy like that. 
Well, listen, I can definitely help you find him, but I've got problems of my own. Maybe we can do a trade. You need my help. There's something I need too. Okay. What do you need? Novak, it's home for me now. I want that to be for good. I like it here, and I've left too many homes behind. But the only resource we got here is junk. Without that, people wouldn't have anything to trade. They'd all have to leave. We get most of it up the road from the old rocket test site, but a bunch of ghouls showed up one day and took it over. We can't get in there now. What needs to be done? Well, they gotta go, or this will be a ghost town before long. <laughs> Doesn't matter to me what you do. As long as the ghouls are out of there, that's good enough for me. Okay. I'll see what can be done about it. It'd mean a lot to me. What was your tour with the NCR like? Oh, it was great. I wouldn't trade it. Something about that lifestyle, the discipline, seeing new places, making people safe, what's not to like. Okay, so why do you leave? Uh, well, I just felt like it was time, you know, wanted to have a home. Plus, I was up at Camp Golf when Bitter Springs went down. I faked like I was sick to get out of going because I knew some of the people there. But when everybody came back, nobody would tell me what happened, and people would call us murderers sometimes when we showed up to secure towns. What did happen at Bitter Springs? I still don't know exactly. Just that a lot of people died who didn't want to be a part of the fighting at all. I don't blame anybody for it. There's so much chaos when you're fighting. You're lucky not to shoot your own guys. But it did take something out of it for me. It just wasn't the same. So when it came time to re-enlist, I just took my papers and walked. Okay. Yeah, see ya. Hmm. Who is that? Where is she looking at? Hey there. Daisy Whitman. Fine weather for flying. It's times like these that make me miss it all. Miss what? You were a pilot? Vertebrate pilot. 71 missions and only lost one chopper. Rotor malfunction over Klamath. Hard landing, but I walked away. Nice. What do you do in Novak? I help folks strip down the more complicated bits of salvage they bring in. Engines, mostly. The bits and pieces we take out are usually worth more than the whole thing put together. Did you fly for the NCR? Four? No, not exactly. It was a long time ago. Things are a lot different these days, and those days are way behind me. Okay, goodbye. Watch your six out there. So the other guy wants me to clear out the test site. This is the test site. But here's a scrapyard. Let's go to the scrapyard. Just up the road. Over there, probably. So that's where they wo work, all of them. At least uh, that's what I understood, that they live from the scrap. And what is this? What was here? It was like some kind of field hospital or something like that, right? Howdy. Oh no, it's a canteen. Okay. Ah, uh, this is the this doctor or something, walking around. Ada Strauss. What did she want? What can want? I do for you? I'm hurt. I need help. I need medical supplies. See you later. Bye. She's a doctor. With two mercenaries with her. So I suppose that road... I came from there, so I suppose that road goes to the test site. And this way I go to the um, scrapyard. What's the weapon I have selected? 
this the cowboy repeater? I suppose it is. Yeah, it is. I need another, another um, um, what's it called? Ah, damn it! Sight for it. This one uh, obscures um, a lot of what I'm seeing. Or said in another way, I don't see much with it. <laughs> Only really down the side, down the barrel, and not much more around me. So it isn't very practical. Go to Gibson's shack. Oh. Large whiskey, mantats. Pump station requires a key. A lot of booze. Jet. Medex. Mantards. A lot of chems. Cigarette. Value, value one and no weight. Oh, it seems like this guy was throwing a party before he died. Lot of cams and cigarettes and alcohol. And the dead guy. So. I guess he wasn't go gonna go out in a bad mood. There's a lot of stuff here. But all single things and hard to pick up. Wood chipper. Okay, that's new. So, I think I found the brunt of it. So, just a, a shack full of drugs. Where's. Is that the. That's rep, Repcon, probably. But where's the scrapyard? Oh, this is the scrapyard, probably. Yeah, looks like it. So, can we get in here? Gibson's scrapyard. That was Gibson's shack. Wasn't it? Where do we get in here? Maybe from this side of the road? Yeah, probably this is the main road. <laughs> okay. So, who are you? Are you Gibson? Hello. Old Lady Gibson. Hi there. I'm Old Lady Gibson, or so they tell me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things, too. Okay. You might have noticed the very large building just north of here. That's Helios 1. The NCR runs the place, so it's off limits to prospectors. Um... I need something repaired? Sure thing. Let me have a look. Trooper helmet. Yeah. Seven hundred caps for this? No. Okay, that's it. What can you tell me about Repcon? Sometimes it seems like I spent the better portion of my youth in that old wreck of a building. 
me and my hubby, may the man rest in peace, used to scavenge there. <laughs> if it weren't bolted down, you can bet we took it and sold it. A lot of the scrap you see around here is from Repcon, even my favorite chair. What do you know about Helios 1? The way I heard it, the Brotherhood of Steel ran the place, before the NCR took it away from them. I'm not sure who started shooting first. But when it was over, the Brotherhood, with all their fancy armor and weapons, was on the run. Nobody's heard from them since. Okay. Um, why do they call you Old Lady Gibson? Well, I'll give you a hint. They used to just call me Gibson. I hope you can figure out the rest. <laughs> yeah. I don't mind, to be honest. Living long is a real accomplishment these days. Remains to be seen if I end up dying peaceful in my bed. Okay. Take care now. So she has a big scrapyard. Gibson Garage. She has a few dogs. And a lot of scrap it seems. Oh, we can take stuff. Carton of cigarettes. Why not? It's not even stealing. Anything interesting lying around here? A few beds? Uh, no, we can't sleep in them. I just heard gunfire, I think. Two empty cans, I suppose this is where... Ooh. I suppose this is where the dogs eat. Um, yeah, not much to do here, it seems. What is this? Yeah, here it's stealing, so not for me. Yeah, okay, let's get out of here. I, I thought this was the place where they would um, take things apart. So, this over here is NCR, she said. So, let's go down there and see what's going on. Let's take some cactus fruit. Helios 1. Oh, it has a lot of solar panels. Maybe that's why they want it. That's what I saw from up there also. Oh, this seems to be a big NCR base. This is a restricted area. State your business. I saw this place in the distance and wanted to investigate. I was hungry and was hoping this was some kind of food factory. Or you're a legion spy trying to infiltrate our perimeter. Give me one good reason I should let you through. Um, this is public property and I can do as I please. You're right, I don't have a reason. I'm glad we sorted this out. Shouldn't there be more people than this defending a power plant? There should, but we're not getting much power out of it, so none of our enemies have big interest in it either. Not like Hoover Dam, anyway. We had a real fighting force here just long enough to take it from the Brotherhood of Steel. Then they got sent east to the dam like everybody else. Caesar's Legion sends skirmishers every so often, prodding for weaknesses mostly. The reality is, if they really wanted it, we'd all be dead. Why was the Brotherhood of Steel here? Damned if I know. Put up a hell of a fight, though. We had them outnumbered, I don't know, 20 to 1 maybe? They held out as long as they could, lost most of their force before they retreated. Gave us a little parting gift, too. They had some of the plant running, but they shut it all down. Enabled an old security system, too, to keep us away from the controls. <sighs> Jerk-offs. Why are you here and not in the front lines? Isn't that more important? I ask myself the same question all the time. But energy is hard to come by around here. Gives you more control over this area than troops ever could. Hell. If we lose the dam to the Legion, this little plant may be our last stand. 
Okay. I'd like to go into the power plant. Why would I want to let you do that? Yeah, you're I'm right. I don't have a reason. Out. Okay. Later. Public property and stuff that doesn't sound very post-apocalyptic. I don't think anyone will take that serious. Okay, so Helios 1 is out of um, out of our reach, at least for now. Mm, there's probably something over there. But let's see, let's go back to Novak. And then we will go either to Rep Redcon? Ren Repcon? Repcon. Yeah. Or to the little town in the east. That was supposedly a nice place and now is run over by the slavers. To see if we can find out something about that trooper's wife or ex-trooper's wife. Ah, oh, this is the main road. I suppose. And where's the dam? I can't be that far away from the dam right now. It wasn't that far from Novak anymore. And there's something with a few windmills. Windmills. So what is that? Is that a farm? Let's see the map. Abandoned Brotherhood of Steel Bunker. The dam is up there. And Novak is here. We still have in Novak. Find out from many wargas where the cans were headed. Okay. Oh. Ask around Novak for information about who kidnapped Bone's wife. Find out from many Vargas where the cans were headed. Huh. Well, let's let's get back there. What is the enemy that I'm seeing? Oh, here. What's that, a mole rat? Yeah, it looks like it. Huh. Haven't seen many of these in this game. In Fallout 3 there was always a lot of those. Yeah, let's go, go back to Novak and see... Um, Uh, he has rats. Yeah? No? Okay. Looked like it. <coughs> Supposedly we can find out from many Novak, uh, from many Vargas, what was going on, where the cans were going. I suppose to New Vegas, probably. Um, and we could ask around for infos about the wife. Of Boone. Careful. You've seen them too, haven't you? I can see it in your eyes. I knew I wasn't the only one. Um what do you know about the abduction of Boone's wife? Seen it all. Seen shadowy folk come to his room and leave again in the middle of the night. Thought one might have gone in the lobby too for a spell. Could be that person went in to get something. Or used the John, maybe. Mighty interesting, either way, you ask me. I thought it was cannibals, come to eat us all for sure. So I kept out of sight. But now I know better. Who was it? More rat men. Come up from the underneath to steal young women with promises of riches and fancy mud mansions <laughs> with all the latest designer appliances. 
They covered our lady folks' long hair for wigs, it said, being either bald or balding themselves. Okay. If anyone um, asked, weird. We never spoke. What was what did the quest? Come fly with me. Um Inside the Dino D lobby lobby. Dino D lobby, okay. But how did we um, get to that conclusion from talking to this guy? From his crazy stuff. Is this the Dino D lobby? Yeah, seems to be. Any clues around here? Hey there. Does she know anything? I hope you're finding everything to your liking. What can you tell me about Boone's wife? How should I put it? I guess you could say she was kind of like a cactus flower. Real pretty to look at, but there was just no getting close to her. She never did take to living here. She liked the big lights and fast living of New Vegas. I got the feeling she was trying to get Boone to leave with her, but I guess she got tired of waiting. What's wrong with Boone? Nothing that wouldn't be wrong with any man who loses a wife, I suppose. Poor dear. I know he thinks she was kidnapped, but I'm not so sure she didn't just run off on her own. You could tell she was thinking about it ever since they arrived. Oh, okay. Watch out for strangers. Huh. Maybe this is... The lobby. What does it say here? No, oh, it's gift shop. So... Look for ev evidence of the guilty party inside the Dino D lobby. You came back. Must be doing something right. Huh. This is all called the Dino D, yes? Anyone else know something? You, who are you? Howdy. Novak Settler. Hey there. No, this one doesn't know anything. I suppose. This is the lobby, I guess. They came out of the ground, he said. Or something like that. Anything at all? Destroyed book, some kind of a vase. Nothing here, empty vending machine. Nothing here. Hey there. Cash register. I don't see anything. Maybe I had to go to the safe? 
Oh wait, maybe in here somewhere? Hmm, doesn't look like it. Maybe I have to wait for night time? Uh, what time is it? 4 p.m. 1, 2, 3, 5, 5 hours maybe? I guess that will be night time enough for her to go home. Nope. When do you go home? Yeah, now you're going home. Okay. Let's see if now we can find something. Souvenir. I'm hearing steps. I'm gonna save before I do this. I don't want to aggro the whole town if it's not needed. Bill of sale. Bottle caps, pre-war money. Weapon spread reduced. Anti-venom, bill of sale. Okay. This sounds bad. Declaration of vital essence. I, Harry Collins, hereby declare stole, sole proprietorship of... Ah, yeah, I, I had written this once already. Vance Gun Brochure. One of the highlights of the museum at the Vicky and Vance Casino is the authentic gun that Vance used in their cross-country crime spree. This gun is proudly on display at the center of the casino near the car where they died. Oh, maybe that's a nice gun. Nighttime Sniper. Many Vargas mentioned that there's another sniper named Boone who works in the dinosaur mouth at night and whose wife went missing. We, the representatives of the Council Officiorum, have this day bargained and purchased from Jenny May Crawford of the township of Novak the exclusive rights to ownership and sale of the slave Carla Boone for the sum of 1000 bottle caps and those of her unborn child for the sum of 5,000 bottle caps. The receipt whereof is hereby acknowledged. We warrant the slave and her young to be sound, healthy and slaves for life. We covenant with the said Jenny May Crawford that we have full power to bargain and sell said slave and her offspring. Payment of an additional 500 bottle caps will be due pending successful maturation of the fetus. The claim to which shall be guaranteed by possession of this document. What the hell? What the hell? What the actual hell? Okay, so this nice little lady was trying to tell me that she ran away. Hey Where is she, you? Let's go. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. Come with me, there's something you should see in front of the dinosaur. Okay, if that's what you think. Wait a second. Um, yeah. You are going to pay for this. With your life. Uh, yeah, suppose I won't be renting a room here anytime soon. And I'm probably not going to have a very good reputation here, but... Boon, are you working? Oh, 
Do it. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. Yes, I am. Watch out for strangers. Safe key, reading glasses. I suppose I don't need... Eh, maybe the key, maybe for her house. She has a house also, yeah, that's right. Okay. So, I guess that's it for her. And it was a silent shot. So, maybe no one will know it was me. Howdy, partner. You are another one of those cowboy guys. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit if it ain't my old friend from Good Springs. Uh... Be seeing you. This is weird. So maybe it was him. But who is he working for? This is strange. Um, yeah, well, it, let's talk to Boone. That's another another thing to think about. But hey, not hey, right hey, now. Must be doing hey, Boone. That's it then. How did you know? I found a bill of sale. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. It'd be like them to keep paperwork. Here. This is all I can give. I think our dealings are done here. Are you an outlaw now? No. People die out there. Often enough that no one worries about blame. They're too anxious to forget it happened in the first place, I guess. Besides, I was on break when it happened. What will you do after this? I don't know. I won't be staying, I know that. Don't see much point in anything right now, except hunting legionaries. Maybe I'll wander. Like you. Uh, no. Yeah. I don't want a companion. At least not for now. How you doing? Oh, the caravan is coming back. So I guess the Legion doesn't kill them on sight. Um, yeah. You! Hey there, friend! What are you doing in Novak? I don't rightly know. I just got the notion to make my way to New Vegas. Reckon I'll find out when I get there. Uh-huh. So what's the story with this place? Novak? Nice enough place, I suppose, but between you and me, when I roll into town, my skin start to itch. Watch yourself. It's nice to see a friendly face out here. Likewise, friend, likewise. Is there anything old Vic can do you for? I could use a bed and some supplies. Well, this ain't New Vegas, but I reckon you can find what you need here. Try the office out front. This guy is shady. You said the men that jumped me were heading this way, right? No, don't believe I did. But you might ask around. The Novak folk usually see anyone traveling this way. Just stay out of my way, robot. No. I don't want to antagonize him. Be seeing you. But I'm really sus suspicious about this guy. Um, this is very weird. So let's see if we can find something in her house. Which one was it? This one? I think it was this one. Does she have another safe here? That I can use the key on. This would all be stealing, but she is dead, so I don't suppose anyone will be bothered. 
and no one's around to see me, so... Well, maybe it was just... the safe in the office. Yeah, looks like it. Okay. <clears throat> so... No renting rooms, I suppose. Yeah. Can I get a key? Doesn't look like it. Let's see who takes over this. Because supposedly someone will have to be renting the rooms out. So let's wait until the morning. Oh wait, it's 12. It's 12 something. Let's see what's going on down there at the farm. If I see someone there. To kill the Brahmin. Is there another dead one already? Yeah. So it already happened. Okay. Huh. So I'm probably too late. Yeah, like I said, let's wait until it's daytime again. And then let's see if sw someone took over the business. If we can rent a room or not, or what's going on now. The caravan seems to go and come and go every day. If I understand it right. No one here. So maybe the rooms are for free now? Or does this guy now handle the business of renting the rooms? Welcome back. Can I get you anything? I killed Jenny May. Do I still get my discount? <laughs> Um, nope, uh, um, yeah, okay. Come back soon now. Hmm. How is my status with this, with these guys? Um, miss? No. Stats. General. Good Springs NCR. General. Good Ranger of the Wastes. Good Springs NCR and Powder Gangers. Here in Novak we don't have any status right now. Um, this guy is supposed to tell me more stuff about... About the, the cans. I'm counting on you. Hmm. No, he's not telling me anything mo else. Yeah, see ya. So, okay, we have to go take care of the ghouls. And no one is renting the rooms right now. So... I thought we could get a room. Maybe can we have a room for free? I mean here it needs a key, but there were some that... Do I have the key? No. There were some that didn't need a key, this one. This one isn't stealing, it doesn't need a key. Ah, but there's a guy in here. Bruce Isaac. Oh, please don't kill me. I swear I'll have... Wait, you... You don't work for Mr. Bishop, do you? No, I don't. What makes you think that? Yeah, I do, and it's time for you to suffer. No. Sorry, it's just... You look like his type, you know? You got that hard-ass wasteland explorer thing going on. Okay, aren't you that singer from New Reno? I think I saw you play at the clubs there. Why would this Mr. Bishop be after you? No, I'm yeah, not interested yeah. in See this right now. 
not interested in this right now. Let's see, do you have anything new to say? Your travel's been going all right? Yeah, fine. I just killed your... What? You're six out there. Motel leader, so you don't need to pay your rent. You should all thank me and pay your rent to me. Uh. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Do we go and look at the new... T at the um, Legion town over there? And slaves and stuff? What is that? The... Uh, Looks like some big letters, letters up there on the mountain, or something. Or do we go clean out the ghouls? Hmm, I'm going to think about that, and while I think, I will put a cut in here. And yeah, hope to see you guys back to see my decision. Um, see you soon, and... Hopefully see you back next time. Bye.